Hello, hello, Renee with Five Men Makeover here, and okay, masks are our new reality. So it's all about smizing with our eyes, right? Who's with me? Okay. Yeah, these things are quite uncomfortable. Um, by the way, just saying, if you are an essential worker and required to wear this all day, every day, please let me know. Okay. So, masking makeup all about the eyes so I'm gonna start with brows this side is done but I figured I would do this side because okay who can relate I love this brow and I like this side of my lashes oh my nails are horrible I need my nail salon open so I swear by our brow palette these are in the gone forever category so right now on my site their wall supplies last but I got you, babe. I got you, babe. I love the dark brow palette personally because did you guys know that brows frame our face? They're the archways to our soul. No, brows can make us look younger. And uh, agent tip number 20 billion and 10. As we age, our brows start to get thinner and sparser and just like non-existent. Um, I do have another little secret tip for that. Um, my Esteem Lash Serum that I put on the top of my lashes, mid lash tip every night, and I gotta stick it by my toothbrush so I remember to use it. You know, you gotta get in the habit. You know, a lot of my girls put it right by the toilet paper at night. Just saying. Well, right? Because when you start something new, you kind of forget sometimes. <laughs> Anyways, I also put my lash serum on my brows. However, we're not talking about last year right now. So, grab your brow palette. I love the brow spoolie brush. This is a bundle that I have today only with this spoolie and, you know, just kind of brush your brows up. That's where your brow should start. Don't put it up your nose. Put it to the side of your nose. That's where your brow starts. Your arch, you know, right in the middle of your pupil. And that's where your brow should end. So we got setting gel, two powders, two creamy luminizer type highlight type things, okay? With this end of the brush, I do a little dippity dip. Less is more. You guys, my stuff is highly pigmented and do a little dippity dip in the dark. And I follow the natural line of my brow, mainly because my brows have been getting all like thick and bushy again. Whoops. Um, product getting stuck to your finger, not part of browing. And then that lighter color, sorry, my husband was behind me doing something and scared the credittle out of me. And then with that lighter color, just do a little side dip. Can you see that? Ew, I got so many fingerprints on my mirror. Do a little side dip, okay. And just like so, and boom. Baby, you be proud. Now, to finish off your look, not all of us have lash glasses with bling, right? Okay. So, unless you're going to walk around rocking your lash glasses, I personally curl my lashes. I swear by Twizzler Man lash curlers. I mean, one, it's hot pink, but two, this one does not damage my lashes. It's for under 10 bucks on Amazon Prime. Curling your lashes does not hurt. My lashes are blonde and they stick straight out. And if I do not curl them, they will poke you in the eye when I hug you. True story. Enter lash crack. Now, if you already have long lashes, I do have other non-fiber lash cracky mascaras. But lash crack is like the best. So, this wand is double-sided and full of lash lengthening goodness you got to get it a little naked okay and then are you ready you just do lightly a little wiggle jiggle twirl wiggle jiggle twirl like you make it into a song that's catchy and then you will never forget wiggle jiggle twirl kind of like the kabuki brush dance with my spray foundation now daily i only use one coat it is non-toxic, naturally based, great for contact wearers. If you are in the itty bitty lash committee, 
<laughs> you're gonna love this wow yeah that's one coat it is not waterproof however i do have waterproof that you could top off with oh 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 a little tip because i always do oops that little spoolie on your brow liner just kind of do a little bloopity bloop and it removes any mascara oops without removing your makeup how many of you guys do your lower lashes show me in the down below raise your hand to give me do you do your lower lashes i do my lower lashes i feel like it makes my eyes look bigger wider brighter anti mombi anti gromby yeah chasing my two-year-old granddaughter around i get such a vigorous workout oh, look i just oops again see that's what happens when i talk about my little grand my grand love shark how, how many grandmas do we have here and my oldest is five, and my youngest just turned two back in May. So, won't there it is. Won't there it is. And for a little extra something, something, white liner, because this is a brow, lash, and liner bundle. White liner is a makeup bag must have, especially with masking. White liner has so many uses, but the main one for this video, put it on your lower waterline. Kapow! Okay, questions. Not sure what brow palette to get. I got one medium and one dark left. They are all out of stock on back order because of COVID on my website. But I got you, boo. And brow spoolie, brush, brow palette, any pencil liner of your choice, and lash crack or any mascara of your choice. I got lash crack. I got regular epic mascara. I have one brown left, I have black, I have blue, I have maroon. And right quick, I meant to keep this video five minutes or less, but lash crack wand, regular epic wand, or look. So it's just all in how you want to lash, but especially in these times, you know, it's not like we can go and get falsies. Um, which, by the way, oh, I almost put the, the wrong wand in the wrong tube. You get the look of falsies anytime you guys want. And you don't have to wait for do some to open things up again. I got you. So, thank you for joining me. We're at 5 in Makeover. I look forward to smizing you with our brow bundle. And I will post the colors in the down below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.